Welcome back. Lexington Fayette Animal Care and Control is reminding pet owners to stay vigilant as the warm summer days are here to stay for a few more months. Yeah, this comes after they say they responded to more than a dozen heat related calls over the weekend. WKYT's Mariah Congito has more. It's a story new at six. Animal Care and Control says of those calls, two of them were deadly, despite their owners being right there with their animal. The weekend's high temperatures kept Lexington Fayette Animal Care and Control busy. They say they responded to roughly 18 heat-related calls. This is the temperature where dogs can die in a matter of minutes. Lieutenant Jai Hamilton says from Friday to Sunday, they had seven calls about dogs left in hot cars. Nine in regard to animals believed to not have the appropriate amount of food, water or shade and two for dogs experiencing heat related illness. One case, the owner was walking their dog down the sidewalk and the dog went into heat stroke. And in the second case, the owner had a proper setup, um, meaning shade and water available. Um, and unfortunately, the heat was just too much for this animal to take and he also went into heat stroke. Hamilton says, unfortunately, both of the dogs died. She reminds people about some of the signs that a dog may be in heat distress. If you notice any behavior changes, so like a, like a lot of panting or drooling, the dog might be acting lethargic or trying to seek shade or seek water, make sure to get them to that to that shade, air conditioning, get them water before they go into heat stroke. Hamilton says if this happens, take them to the vet immediately. When temperatures are above 90 degrees, she says people should only let their animals outside for a short amount of time. I've seen dogs go into heat stroke just playing ball with their owner. So, you know, you never really know when it can happen. So just make sure you're paying attention to your dog. Hamilton says one emergency call is too many. So people need to stay aware and make a report if something doesn't seem right. Our animals do rely on people to pay attention what's going on, who needs help, and then alert the authorities when needed. As a reminder, Lexington is still under a phase one heat alert until tomorrow night. Lexington Fayette Animal Care and Control says if you have any questions regarding your pet safety throughout the summer months or at any time at all, go ahead and give them a call. In Lexington, Mariah Congito, WKYT.